We'll see what he does when I walk a little closer. I'm going to see. Get him up and get him out of his bed. He's gone. This is a wallow I found up and uh, just scouting around up here. You know, it was a pretty hot day and in the afternoon I figured I'd go for a good jaunt and I come up and to this big back timber in here. And uh, down on the bottom here, it was a really nice wallow. I'm gonna set a trail cam up here, so that'll be my eighth trail cam I'm gonna set up here. Um, it uh, looks like it's gonna be pretty active when the rut comes. There's a real, good game trail coming in here. Um, it's uh, coming right into the, to get drink the water here. This is the trail here. It's coming in this way. I think there's another one over here too. Yeah, that's a good trail there coming in from that side there. Anyways, it'll be set up right over here. There's the wallow. There's uh, where I'm gonna put the salt, where that canister is with the salt in it. I cleared the bush all the way here. I snapped all the twigs off uh, undergrowth here. I'm gonna play where my shotgun is. I'm gonna put the trail cam right there. It's about, uh, probably about uh, 50, 20 feet away from where that bait's going to be, like the salt, so it'd be a direct good shot right through. This is where the tree is, and this is where it's going to be about, about, I guess, 20 feet, 
to where the salt's going to be in the water's there so they can drink water. Be interesting to see what's in here. It's a cool area. Anyways, I'll come back in another week and see what you know, want to come up with. I can set up uh, myself climbing tree stand on any of these trees. I just got to pick out the right one. I'll have to find one to you know, pick out here. That looks like a pretty good one right through there. I just have to limit up and go up about, you know, 15, 20 feet there. It'll be that one right there, I think. Yeah, it'll be about uh, 20 yards. Maybe not even that, 18 yards. That tree right there. Might even go back there, that one there. That's about uh, 30 yards. <clears throat> I got a pack alarm here. You know, on my camper here on the on the jack here, and I'm going to end up uh, activating. And I tried it late earlier today, and everything worked good. So I'm going to pull the string out and. Put it around my camper. I'm gonna go from that pole to this pole. Now I'm back to the pack alarm. I'll put this little trigger in here. I'll put a little tension on this here line. Put it on this. Put it on the sen sensitive side. So now, if anything comes in here, if we're on my camper, and I hit this line. There, it's all set up. I'll get a warning if something comes in here tonight. I'm going to keep that uh, set up uh, whenever I go to bed. Yep. It's all set up. Today is um, August the 16th, uh, Thursday at uh, 6.30 a.m. 
2012. I'm filming the top of my truck here. It got down to freezing last night. Pretty cold for the middle of August. Scratch your ice. She froze last night. Got a load of this here old larch to take home. Truck's full. Yeah, it froze last night. Today is Thursday, um, August the 16th. 2012 at 7 a.m. It got down to minus, or no, it got down to 1.8 Celsius last night, and there's frost on the top of my truck, so it got pretty chilly in here last night. This morning I said that it was um, uh, 4,600 feet above sea level, my camp here, but I was wrong. It's um, I just did a conversion, and uh, it's 1,144 meters above sea level and it uh, works out to 3,600 feet. That's my elevation of my hunting camp. So I was wrong, but I corrected myself. Today is uh, Tuesday, August the 14th, 2012. I come up here where uh, that big buck was last year. There's a couple of them in here. And the one that I wanted, my green buck, whitetail, it was coming down here, you know, in the dark last year, you know, late, um, August and uh, early September, but he was coming in the dark. So anyways, I put this salt block up here. My batteries run dead here about three weeks ago, so I took the trail cam out. It was on that uh, tree right there, or I should say that stump there, about, uh, you know, about uh, 25 feet away. But anyways, they've been licking this a bit, but not a lot. The white uh, salt's still here, you know, from you know, water softening salt. I brought some more up. I didn't, I didn't realize that I had um, the solid block here, the trace mineral, but I did, so I won't have to come up here with probably any more salt the rest of the year, so that's good. I packed that up here. I'm gonna put my trail cam up, and I'm gonna set it up and see what uh, the next couple weeks bring here.